school district is trying to make every dollar count with four football schools, uh, four football high schools that is, uh, needing a stadium. Multi-million dollar upgrades here. The district turned to Drake University with a proposal. Rather than renovate, the two forces joining for an all new stadium, $20 million price tag, but multi-purpose, which is important. The district saved more than $40 million going this avenue. WHO 13's Andy Fales was there for the ribbon cutting. Uh, more than that, Andy, I mean, they actually got to play there tonight. And you were talking about just the locality of the stadium with Drake and how close the roads are to it. It is indeed unique. It is a neighborhood stadium, Elias, and many of us have watched the stadium go up on Forest Avenue. It's right there. And that's my initial reaction. It fits right into the neighborhood and fills what was an unsightly hole on Drake's campus. Now, it fills more holes than that. It gives Drake's Division I soccer teams a true home on campus, and it gives four Des Moines public schools the first new football or soccer facility they have had in decades. Now, this plan is not popular with everyone. Many fans didn't like the idea of taking football games, such a big deal in the community, out of their community and moving them over to Drake, where they'll have to share the field with other schools. Even the athletic directors at these schools have had to warm up to the idea. With all new things, there's some going to be some positive reviews and negative reviews with all new things. I wish it was at Hoover, right? Everybody, of course, wants this type of thing at their school. But when you have five high schools, that's not very, very likely to happen for each school. I know our soccer community is super excited about the stadium. And I think our football community, once we get in here and play a game, they're going to be excited about the stadium. But when our kids, again, come out on a brand new facility that is a, on a college campus and walk out onto the field, I think they're going to say this is a pretty cool place to play football. There are ways that this is going to benefit more than just student athletes. Band, cheerleaders, dance, you know, our student media piece, rugby, other clubs and organizations. It's going to be a fantastic addition to Duane. So that is uh, Drake AD Brian Harden there at the end. He tells me his favorite part of this new stadium is how close the fans are to the action. Now, there's no track around the outside of the field, so they're that much closer. And Elias, the field is set down from the road so that those in the neighborhood can literally look in on the games right from Forest Avenue. Now that is really going to change the feel of that whole part of town. I think that's a good thing. Yes, and uh, you, you're up the press box too, right? Pretty fancy, pretty nice. The press box is really, really nice, and it will have room for student media groups to get up there and uh, do what they uh, would like to do and learn as well. And take our jobs someday. Yeah, right. All right, yeah, thanks, Andy. Generation.